Hey, it's Joel, and I'm in spring break capital of the world, Orlando, Florida. Wait, actual spring break capital of the world, Orlando, Florida. And I'm at Give Kids the World Village, an 89-acre storybook resort where critically ill children and their families can come for a week-long cost-free vacation. This gives them the opportunity to explore and take advantage of everything that Central Florida has to offer. But here at the village, there's something really cool. It's brand new, and I want to show you. It's Mayor Clayton's Wonder Lab, and I want you to meet my friend Christy. Hey, Christy. Hi, Joel. Good to see you. Good to see you as well. Uh, Mayor Clayton's Wonder Lab. The Wonder Lab, really inspiring kids with all sorts of steam things. As far as the activities go, I, I see lots of stuff around us, but we seem to be in a place very familiar to me because we have some cool 3D printers going behind That's us. That's right. How did this happen? Well, we're standing in Tech 101. This is one of six different rooms that we have here at Mayor Clayton's Wonder Lab. And we really wanted to make sure that 3D printing was a part of our STEAM lab. Uh, we know that it's the coolest technology that there is right now. And we also know that kids love it. They're excited by it, but a lot of them haven't ever seen it in person. So we wanted to inspire them in that way. And so we actually got these amazing printers from Bamboo Labs. Amazing. We got two different styles. We got A1s and P1Ss and we're loving them. And uh, every single day that kids walk in here, they get to see them working on creating really cool stuff that they end up getting to take home with them. One of the parts that it's making though is here, right? It's That's a, right. It's a loom. We have a few different types of looms. Um, this is actually a tapestry loom. And so this is the loom part. It also comes with a comb and a needle. I remember something like this. When I was a kid, I think with friendship bracelets back in grade school, this looks way better. This is very, very similar. And we actually have a totally different loom that creates friendship bracelets as well. So we have the tapestry one and we have the friendship bracelet I, one. Absolutely, go for it. The okay. over, under, over, under method. Right. Remember that from camp, from I summer do, camp? Yep. Yeah, there you okay. go. There we, oh, the dexterity needed. Perfect, you got it. Look at that, okay. You can tamp it down with your comb. <laughs> Look at that. I did that. Yeah, and it looks great. There's just something so special about seeing something 3D printed to inspire kids to create. Absolutely. This is fun. And what we like to tell kids is that you're utilizing one of the newest technologies to create one of the oldest art forms. Now I see yellow, I see purple, we've mm -hmm. got blue. Yes, we've made sure to have a rainbow of filaments uh, available to them. And you're using the bamboos. What kind of filaments are you using here? Um, we have an amazing connection with Polymaker and American Filament. This one kids really get hypnotized by. And uh, there's Braille on here. There is Braille. We serve a wide variety of families. So we wanted to make sure that no matter what sensory challenge they have when they come into the Wonder Lab, that they still get to do everything. Have you heard from kids or the families that they've continued with their 3D printing? Uh, one little girl was talking about how she was gonna make bracelets for all the nurses <laughs> next time she was in treatment. So, you know, things like that really make us very, very happy because that's the whole point, is to make sure that we give them something, we teach them something about 3D printing, weaving, and and then they continue that as they leave here. And to be honest, we're, we're a nonprofit, so we wouldn't be able to do this without very generous sponsors like Polymaker. So their long-term commitment means a lot to us, and it just means that we get to give more to kids and inspire more kids to keep trying and keep going. Awesome! There's cool stuff in front of us, so this must mean we're in some sort of testing room? That's very close. We're in the test and try lab. Yes. So this is where kids get to build, create, test, and try some ideas. And in this case, what is, have they built and tested and created? So this project that we have open today is hydraulic machine building. And so what we've done is we've created hydraulic pumps, and kids get to take these, build a machine with these pumps embedded, and it becomes a moving machine. And so here we have one of our samples that kids can build if they'd like. So why don't you go ahead and push on this hydraulic and really? see what happens, yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh. Very nice. Look at that. And then obviously being hydraulic. You can pull, pull it back, back the other way, that's right. That's amazing. Now the parts here, laser cut wood. Yes, that is correct. But I know that you guys have been getting into the 3D printing a lot, so mm -hmm. I would imagine that's gonna play a role here. That's right. Um, what we noticed is sometimes the kids pull, they get really excited, and they pull the plungers out. And so oh. um, a friend of ours created little clips right here that you can see. And so these clips get attached on, 
and then we tape around them. And a volunteer was the one that came up with this idea. And I know you have a lot of volunteers here. Yes, volunteers are literally the heart and soul of what we do here at the village. At any given day in the Wonder Lab in particular, we have between five and seven facilitating all of these amazing activities. Now, I have one more thing that I was really hoping to show you. Do you have a little bit more time? I do, let's do it. Fantastic. Now we're in another room and, okay, so let me set the stage for everybody out here. We're against some really cool stuff and on the wall behind you is make cool stuff. What goes on here? This is called Volts and Bowls Studio and that means that we're in our animatronic studio. So we have two different experiences for animatronics here, okay. all given to us by Garner Holt Productions, which we are very thankful for. and they provided us two experiences. One, we have three different three-foot animatronics called Sparkies that kids get to program and play with and puppeteer. And what's so cool about them is that they have clear bodies. So kids get to see all the servos, they see how they work from the inside. And then the second experience that we have is our Tiki Bird experience. And this one is one that we're working on right now. And kids will get to come in here, see all of the pieces of parts of how you would build a Tiki Bird like this, but also they get to see the raw material of how those pieces and parts get made. Are the kids actually building the bird? Yes, they get to be a part of the bird build. So if you'd like to, we have the body, the beak, and the head all ready to be played with. So if you'd like to move one of these sliders, you'll see it move. I would. Really? <laughs> yes, really? please do. Yes. Okay. <laughs> all the birds say word and the flowers grow in the tiki 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 room. Oh my gosh, that's amazing! Yeah, they're pretty awesome. And what's so cool is that, yes, the end result is amazing, but the way that the kids get to see how they're built literally from the inside out really inspires them. And we actually have been 3D printing a lot of the bird heads recently to get ready for this experience. So there's one of them. Oh, look at that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, is that on the Ultimaker behind us? That's right. Garner, oh. Holt, Garner Holt gave us all the things that we would need in order to create all the pieces and parts. So we have a vacuum former, we have an Ultimaker 3D printer, and we also have a mini CNC, a mini mill. I'm, I'm just, I'm just blown away. Thank you. This is, this is really amazing. And all of these experiences are a part of a much larger experience when they come and stay here. And really what we're trying to do is make sure kids, one, have the best experience of their entire life. Life. We want them to have an excellent vacation with their family. We also want to open them up to new experiences to provide some hope for the future. I'll tell you what, at this point, I want you to look in the camera right there and tell the audience where they can go to find out more about either donating, volunteering, or both. Okay, wonderful. It's yours. If you're interested in donating or volunteering here at the Wonder Lab or at Give Kids the World, you can go to our website at gktw.org. We will also be starting Wonder Lab Wednesdays, where every Wednesday we're gonna be throwing out something on social media, Wonder Lab related. Well, that's cool. Well, links, everything down below as well. Well, thanks for making this far, because if you did, you're awesome. Don't forget to hug each other more. Fight for a cause you believe in and inspire all the kids. And as always, high five. Nailed it. Awesome.